afternoon everyone. I just want to take you through my entry for Shed of the Year. So this is my old pigeon loft which has been renovated. Started back in August 2020, so just in the midst of lockdown. So there used to be an old shed here on our allotment plot. It's fallen down, loads of issues with it. So what we decided to do is I'm going to contact with my dad and we decided that we we're going to do some work on it. And then this is how you'll find it now. So we've got a huge allotment plot. This is the top level. There's a feather level at the bottom as well. So plenty of light coming at the shed with decking all round. We just go into the building. Then this is the inside. So most of the materials that we've used have been recycled. So the whole building's made out of pallets. Just stacked together, screwed together, and then we managed to get a big set of windows out of a, a house renovation that was going ahead from one of the lads that I know. So it's a big old shed, L shape. You can see the double doors looking out onto the allotment. Quite a bit of work that we need to do there. So this is the main seating area with the log burner. Great for during winter to be able to come down with the kids. We have four kids so they're able to come down. A um, bit different with the, the ceiling. So this is from um, a fallen down tree that we had I think it was last year in one of the storms so we decided to make use of it put some fairy lights on it and then this is the lighting that we've got and then there's another feature on the wall there so as we come back round kitchen which was donated the sink was 30 pounds um, and then the top is just scaffolding boards You can see a cable reel, so the other end is on the, the top of the table. So I made this just out of a clock piece that you can get in most stores. I think it was Home Bargains I got it in. And then all the numbers are individually drilled screws. So a couple of features that you'll, you'll see. Um, first one I'm going to show you is the Murphy table. So you can see there at the minute there's four seats. If you don't know what a Murphy table is, it's a drop down table that drops out the wall. So really simple. We just need to take the centre post out. Keeps it locked in. Turn the catch over. And then it just pulls down. There you go. You can just move the seats around. Really simple, dead easy for working as an office. Or if the kids come up and they want to do some work, if we have food as a family. And again, it's just as simple as lifting the back up. Lock it up. And then put the centre post back in. Next thing I want to show you is the toilet door. So you may have seen this in the national newspapers, there's been quite a few videos about it. So I wanted to do something different to get access to the toilet. So a little Harry Potter trick. You push the door, it doesn't open. So if you pull the book and then push, it opens up. So a really simple toilet. Again, we've got the grass on the floor. And as we come round, you've got the beano wall. 
So you'll see little bits of character from when I was younger. So these are out my mum and dad's loft. And then there's a a friend's created a little art challenge, a little character on there as well. So really, really simple. And functional as well. And obviously we've got tiles. Not very often you'll come into a shed and see tiles in there. That was my first proper go of tiling. So as we come back out, we've then got a little secret cubby hole. It's nice and easy. Take the keys off. And then if we pull, then I've just got hatchet and lighter for the wood burner. It's really, really simple again. Just opens up. And then we have another surprise. So people have always said, why have you not got a bed? Well, I do, it's just not obvious. So I'll quickly move this out of the way. <laughs> Obviously keeps the light out from behind and then there's the bed pop a duvet on pillow nice and comfy really really easy so this is the shed um, it's also been named Buckingham pallets because it, the fact is it's just made out of pallets so really really simple really easy really sturdy And then on a beautiful day like this, I can open up the windows, open up the door, and then we've got a beautiful view outside. And the sun just starting to go down. So, thank you very much for watching. Enjoy.